these collages are so cool. It just takes so much work to cut and copy and paste and get all the labels in there. Well, not anymore. Welcome to SETI Astro. I have just added what I think is one of the coolest features for what's in my image. A collage generator for all your uh, markers and objects you've found. So again, you'll need a astrometrically solved image and then under scripts, city astro, what's in my image. And on it now, you'll see a new checkbox that says save collage of objects. Let's go ahead and do an advanced search on my Andromeda here for all the supernova remnants. So you could open up the advanced search. It has all the different search types here. Uh, you can go ahead and confirm selection. I'm going to query the entire image. Okay, so here's all the supernova remnants that found, and you can see them listed down here. Now, if you click Save Collage of Objects and click Save Annotated Image, it's going to take it a second depending on how many images you have, but it's going to create a collage. So we're going to call this one um, Andromeda Supernovas. Uh, you could save it as a JPEG or a PNG or a TIFF. Uh, there's, there's a couple of different ones in the drop down. And then the next save as that comes up, it says save annotated image. So it immediately allows you to save the entire annotated image as you, if you want, or just click cancel and it's done. Check this out. Andromeda supernovas. Here they are. So it went and pulled all the markers and put the labels underneath them for all the different uh, objects you had in what's in my image. So not only can you save just the annotated version, you could pull out all those objects and it will automate a collage for you. Now I have my image of Triangulum here. Triangulum is just full of all sorts of nebula and stuff. So let's go ahead and make a little collage of some of these items as well. And maybe we don't want all the items, so I'll show you some other expanded functionality that's in this new version of what's in my image. So again, we can go advanced search. This time, let's go ahead and search for all the H2 regions. Confirm selections, query the entire area. Now there's a lot. There's 947 objects, and they're, they're all in here. But you'll notice some of them are just point-like. Uh, there's, no, there's no size. So maybe those aren't objects you want. You could filter by diameter, click on the first one, and then just scroll down until you stop seeing ones that are of zero diameter. Here, if you shift click, it'll highlight a bunch of them. And now if you go into annotation tools, you can click delete marker and it'll delete all those. So now you're only left with ones that have uh, physical size, at least in the catalog. And then from there, you can go ahead and save your collage. This is Triangulum H2 regions. And I don't want the annotated image. So let's just go ahead and see what those look like. Here's Triangulum H2 regions. So now here's our big collage of all the different H2 regions in Triangulum. I, I especially like RVP 2013-99. It, it looks like a smiley face. Uh, but you, you can do it with anything. You're, you're looking for galaxies, you want to pull up your quasars, you just want carbon stars, whatever markers you have and what's in my image can now be turned directly and quickly into a collage. Another way you can utilize the filtering and deleting, let's, let's look at all the H2 regions again. And you can see that if you filter on name, there's various catalogs that really uh, have been built up over the years on these. So maybe you just want to keep the this 2017 catalog the LHK 2017 so you can go ahead and just remove the markers 
uh, that don't correspond to that. So we can delete those ones above it. And we'll scroll down to just below it. And then just scroll all the way at the end, shift click to highlight them all, delete the markers. So now this is just the LHK 2017 catalog. And again, just save collage of objects, save annotated image. And this is the LHK 2017 catalog. So let's just go ahead and, and save that. And I, I don't need the annotated image right now, but let's go ahead and, and look at that one. So now here's all the objects in the LHK 2017 catalog. I, I think it's just such a great and easy way to do this now. Um, I'm just really excited about the whole thing. Uh, I want to give a shout out to, you know, the, the community for giving these suggestions and uh, giving me these challenges to try to uh, create these new additions in the scripts to make everything more interesting and easier for us to uh, present our hard-earned data in all these different ways. I hope you liked the video. Please comment, like, and subscribe.